please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Title, Troubleshooting Django Template for Loops, HTML, CSS, and Python. Django is a powerful web framework that facilitates the development of web applications by using the Model View Controller, MVC, architectural pattern. In this tutorial, we will focus on troubleshooting issues related to for loops in Django templates, and how HTML and CSS play a role in rendering dynamic content. Before diving into this tutorial, make sure you have the following. Django templates use the percent for percent percent and for percent syntax to iterate over a sequence, such as a list or query set. Here are common issues and solutions related to for loops in Django templates. Ensure that you are using the correct syntax for the for loop in your Django template. The opening tag is percent for item in items percent and the closing tag is percent and for percent. Ensure that the variable you are iterating over in the for loop is defined and accessible in the template. If you are using a query set from a view, make sure it is passed to the template context. If your for loop is not working, check if the data you are trying to iterate over is empty or doesn't contain the expected values. HTML and CSS play a crucial role in rendering the output of your for loop. Ensure that your HTML structure and CSS styles are compatible with the dynamic content generated by the for loop. Let's consider an example where a for loop is not rendering as expected. In this example, make sure that the name attribute exists in your model and is correctly referenced in the template. Troubleshooting for loop issues in Django templates involves checking syntax, variable scope, data presence, and ensuring compatibility with HTML and CSS. By following the guidelines in this tutorial, you should be able to identify and resolve common problems related to for loops in your Django projects. ChatGPT